Hey fellas, welcome back to another episode of what? The Bobby Boy Science Lab! <laughs> Let's have a seat, sir. All safety precautions are taken in the lab, right? Okay, so today we are doing an experiment called candle pump water. So for this one, you guys are going to need a pigment, a plate, a candle, some water, and a measuring cup. All right, and we'll show you the setup we've got going on here. All right, so we got little plates and our candles with our water. And we got our pigment and our droppers there. And we are ready to rock and roll. Okay, so for the first step, what we're gonna do is pour water into our white plate. So Aiden, go ahead and take your candle off the plate. And pour water in there. Okay, let's get some water in Ari's plate over here. Let's get some water in Ari's plate. All right, all right, and now what we're going to do is drop three drops of pigment and stir well, okay? So get you some colors. So next we're gonna drop three drops of pigment. Aiden, go ahead and drop your three drops, sir. All right, so we've got his three drops of pigment in there. Looking good, looking good. Okay, all right, let's go ahead and get your three drops. All right, all right, got yellow in there. Looking good, sir, looking good. Okay. Okay, so next it says put the candle in the middle of the plate. All right, Aiden, so go ahead and set your candle right there in the middle of the plate. All right. Ari, right, go ahead, drop your candle in the middle of the plate. Put it right in the middle of the plate in the water, Ari. Right. There you go, right there. Good job, yes sir. Okay, so our next stage is to light the candles. Adults. All right, Aiden's got his candle lit. Let's get, all right, Ari, let's light Ari's candle. All right, got Ari's candle lit. All right, now the last thing it says, hold on Aiden, before you do it, place a cup upside down on the candle and water will be sucked up in the cup. So let's see how this works. Cool stuff. It sucked it all the way up in there. Nice. Let it go. Uh, did the candle go out? Yeah. Yeah. The candle's out. All right, let it out. Let's see what it does. Okay. Whoa! Nice. The water's still there. I need to tell to clean up the candle. It's clean okay. up on aisle one. Clean up on aisle one. Okay, Ari, it's your turn. So we're gonna put the cup on Ari's. Oh. Whoa, cool stuff, dude. That's just cool. I need to bake the dice. So it sucked it up into the cup. Clean up on aisle two, please. Clean up on aisle two and aisle one, please. All right, so the scientific principle, it says, while the measuring cup was placed upside down on the candle, the air in the cup will heat up. According to the principle of expansion and contraction, the air in the cup will expand and overflow. Oxygen in the cup will be consumed after a few seconds and the candle will extinguish. All right, man, that was a cool one. All right, fellas, so did you enjoy that experiment? All right. Like and subscribe for more videos. All right. We'll see you guys soon. Peace out from the Bubby Boy. See ya. See ya later, guys. All right. <laughs>